Hello everybody, this is Jerry from Kill Clowns FPV. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to do the firmware update for the uh, Trudy V3 to the new firmware, the 3.6 that just released. Um, or it's actually going to release, I believe, within the next hour or so, the beta. Um, so here we have the module. This one already has USB, so no issue to do it through uh, FTDI. Um, we'll go ahead and plug it in just using a simple micro USB cable here. And then set that to the side. Now we'll get on the screen next. Alright, so now that we're here on our desktop, uh, these are the three files you're going to need. When you actually download Xloader from the Furious FPV page, you'll have these two. Now, you have the Pololu, uh, the CP2102 uh, driver. This is if you haven't already installed it. Um, you just go about either choosing your 64-bit or uh, the 32-bit. Um, once that's installed, however, you just open up the uh, Xloader app and you'll notice you'll have the application right here start that up and hit run um, close off that one set it right here so for as far as the device settings you'll want to have it on the second option which is the uh, nano at mega 328 um, and then baud rate you're gonna want it at 57 600 um, your hex file you'll have it here wherever you might have it as you can see it is a 3.6 so you can go ahead and choose whichever one it may be and I have it on the desktop now so you'll go ahead and choose the hex and have it right there com port is already chosen so I have com5 all you gotta do is hit upload and then just wait for that to get done it should only take a couple of seconds um, normally it's about 15 seconds it doesn't take long um, <coughs> go ahead and let it do its thing there you go so you'll get 3582 uh, bytes uploaded and you'll just notice the uh, status lights on the actual module flash green blue and then go back to red so you can go ahead and close it um, now let's go back to the module I'll go ahead and power it up I have it here on my dock and you'll now see on your next startup you got your revision 3.6 and that nice new GUI and that's how you install the 3.6 firmware on your Trudy module. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time.